If you have a cafe and you're constantly opening up lots of liters of milk and having all that wastage and recycling that you have to deal with, then the Keg Master Mini is exactly what you need for being able to dispense lots of dairy for your retail needs. So I'm gonna show you today how the Keg Master Mini and the dairy dispense setup for it are gonna help you in whatever you have, whether it's a cafe or a bar or any other hospitality place. Even if you wanted to use this at home, you could, because Keg Master Mini is easy, very portable, very simple to set up. I'm gonna show you how we use it with 10 liters of milk. So the first thing you wanna do is to get supplied with 10 liter bags of milk. They usually come in a cardboard box, that looks just like this. Your dispensing network might look a little different than this one, but mostly all these 10 liter bags come in a cardboard caddy to begin with. But we're just gonna go ahead and here's the 10 liter bag in here already. What we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and get the caddy out of this put it onto our bag, get the bag into our system, and then we can just leave it. It will dispense under gravity, and as we do so, this makes it really simple to just take the amount of milk that you need to work with while leaving the rest of it behind to stay cold inside this unit. You start by taking off the canopy, and this is the milk caddy. So this will be situated inside the system already, and within this, you're gonna find this piece here, this conical shaped piece, is gonna fit on the bag inside this box. So you can see this. I'm gonna go ahead and open this box a bit on the side. So you can see that the bag has this nozzle on it here, which is what we need to put onto this here. Here, now on the bag here, I'm not sure if you can see this perfectly, but there is a little ridge. There's one place where it hooks in to the caddy conical piece here. So we really want to be careful, but that's where it slides right in, just like that, and that's it. So now that you've got the nozzle in place here, you'll see on the cap itself, on the bag, there's an arrow usually pointing to which way it opens. So in this case, our arrow is pointing this way. So we're gonna grab the cap here and just open it just like that, right? So now this is open. The next thing that we have to do is we're just gonna put the caddy directly over the top of it, just like this. That slides right into place, just like that. And now what I would do, stand the box just straight up like that. Now your milk bag is kind of flopping around there like that, but it is ready now to actually go into the unit. Now within the unit, there is a single pipe sticking up. The nozzle that's at the base of this bag is going to get penetrated by the pipe that's sticking up here when we put the caddy into place. Now it's really not that heavy. So if you have employees or anybody who has trouble lifting more than say 10 kilos, probably get somebody else to do this, but really it's only about 10 kilos worth of weight. This next part, we lift this caddy and we put it in here so that it gets penetrated by the pipe inside here so we can have tap service. Make sure that your tap is off before you do this. There are two arches on the caddy. They go front and back. That's the way to orient them. So this front arch here will face out towards the tap or it can face to the back. It doesn't matter. The central point of it is gonna be exactly where we need to. So we'll go ahead and lift this into place orient it so that that arch is out the front. When you put it down, you'll actually feel it make the connection. And as I set it down, ooh, got a couple of little leaks right there, but that's no big deal. Well, that's it. That'll go straight into your drip tray. If you do get leaks with an auto return spring, you'll have no issue. Now, the next thing you wanna do, get the canopy back on it so it stays nice and cold in there. Now you've got the tap for service anytime that you need cold milk. You're just gonna go ahead and dispense. It's dispensing under gravity. There's no need for gases or anything like that to be able to dispense. It's just gonna use its own natural weight to dispense the bag through the caddy and out the tap. At the end of a service, it's very simple to remove the tap if you needed to and clean everything so that you can go ahead and put another bag in. And again, 10 liters of service every single time. So if you're going through a lot of different packaging in your cafe or your restaurant, 
because of milk products, this is the solution. Doing bulk milk like this with a caddy inside of a Keg Master Mini. It's a smart way to do it so that you can keep it cold, serve sanitarily every single time and make it easier for you with your recycling space and for your staff. Thanks for watching. We'll also show you how to clean this tap system and the whole entire system. Super simple where you can even just use dishwashers for a lot of the parts. Thanks again.